And we're back for another stage of Mega Man and Base. I've been gone for a little while, but I'm feeling better, and we're gonna take on Burner Man now. Isn't that right, Base? That's right! Ready? Always ready! Let's go! Yeah! Huh! Alright. The first bit of this stage is usually pretty easy. You know, just a matter of. You know, aiming properly. Yeah. Piece of cake. Then, up oh, secret! See? You just jump right through that at your base. Excellent. Get the bolt, and we're moving on. Oh. This part's kind of tricky. If you want to get it, like, perfect, if you can get, like, half of your foot on there. Ah! Oh, crap! You okay? Of course I'm okay! Ugh. Son of a... If you can get, like, half of your foot on that platform, you can just stand there and shoot it. But it's really quite difficult. <sighs> Forget it! Just die already! Uh... <laughs> You right there, face? You seem a little upset. Of course I'm upset! I was just getting the crap blasted out of me! How would you feel? Sorry. I asked. Right then. So, we uh, destroy him by shooting him in the toes, collect the health, and we're off. Oh! Uh. Hey, we're not doing so well. We're already down to half health. I'll be fine! you say so, man? I don't know. Is this game, uh, is this stage give us much health? I can't recall. Is it, oh, no, crap, son of a... Okay. Alright, those, uh, weird shielding-looking platforms have holes in them that you cannot see. So, my advice, use the dash and jump. Or just, you know, like, double jump or something. Don't ever just walk across them. That's that's bad, bad juju. Okay. And I believe the hole for that one is right under those guys I just destroyed. Okay. Moving on. This guy is a pain. It's rather difficult to get under that thing. Okay. So you get up to the very top of the ladder, shoot down at him. As easy as that. Awesome, he gave us health! Feeling better? Oh yeah! Moving on! Hyah! Yes! The awesome part about these guys is you can destroy their weapon. Like we just did. His? No, not allowed. It totally sucks. If you time your shots right, like a thousand times, you can destroy him and not take any damage. If you do take any damage, you might get lucky and he'll give you some HP. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Jump, shoot, after he throws that. <sighs> Man, I hate doing this. Ah, son of a... Oh, you are so gonna die for that. Alright! Awesome. Okay, now, before you guys say anything, you may notice there are some, like, cuts in this video. Reason for that is the, uh, re the recorder I'm using is built into the game, and for some reason, the longer you record, um, the audio and video starts to desync. Um, so, yeah, when I start over, when I... I'll stop recording for a moment, then start recording again, and, and then it'll sync up. So, yeah, that's what that's that's what that is. Okay. So, strategy here. Base, would you like to uh, would you like to go into this? All right. First of all, don't jump down off of this platform unless it's for really big health. Okay. Right. Like that one. Yeah, but we don't need it right now. But we're missing health. We can get health later! We're fine! Okay. Gosh. Okay, go on. Another thing. Jump and shoot the big rhino-looking guy. 
whenever he's not shooting his horn. Okay. Shoot down at the lower bird bots. Shoot straight at the higher bird bots. You'll never need to shoot up. Okay. Good to know. And here, what? what is... Oh my gosh! Okay, fire. <laughs> Stop spazzing out! I'm sorry. It scared me. That's instant death fire. Oh, yeah, people. That is instant death fire. Uh, if you get caught in it, you're instantly dead. Oh, nice strategy there, base. Knew he was coming, huh? I had a sense. Had a sense? I had a feeling. Whatever. <laughs> okay, so we destroy him. We wait for the fire to go away. That is some funky looking fire. Anyways. Okay. What was that? I. Uh, shut up! Sorry. You want me to come out there and. Uh, no, no. No. That's okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so. Wow! Look at all the health we have! Holy crap! Okay, little cute uh, clue about this dragon. Don't shoot him anywhere but the head. If you shoot him anywhere else, his body will become lighter and he'll start moving faster. And then he's just going to eat you up really fast and just destroy you. So, base? I'm ready! Right. Burner Man! Use the ice wall. Let's go! Huh. Ugh! What the heck? That's not the way he fought last time I fought him. Oh, yeah. I should probably mention, Burner Man's uh, pattern isn't always the same. It, it ha Its basics are the same. You know, like, he'll do that, and then he does this thing. But it's not always in the same place. So he's, he's pretty tricky. The key to beating him, base? Don't be afraid! That's right. See? If you're not afraid of him... You should be able to beat him fairly easily. You won't have much health left, <laughs> but you'll kill him. Oh. <laughs> awesome. New powers. What did we get this time, base? Let's find out! You got Wave Burger. Oh, neat! It's like a fiery tail. Sweet. Alright. Well, that's it for Mega Man and Base. Burner Man! This is the HLT Ninja. And Base! And we're signing... Hey, what are you doing? I'm going on! Um, but we were supposed to sign off. Well, I feel like doing something else. Okay. What? You're gonna take on another boss in the same video? No, I'm gonna go here! What the heck is this place? Oh, yes. This is what I like to call the giant bolt area. Because they don't really look like screws to me, they look like bolts. Okay, so yeah, in each of these rooms, if you use the proper power on those funky blocks, you can get a really, really big bolt, or screw, that is worth a hundred. Isn't that sweet? Alright, uh, I'll show you real quick. All right, base, ice wall. Excellent. See that? And now we just got a hundred more. It's a very useful area once you figure out which powers go with which room. And, um, yeah. So that's the bolt area. See? Check this out. 245. All right, well, this has been another... Episode of Mega Man and Base. This is the HLT Ninja and Base, and we're really signing out this time.